The honor guard was moved from inside the Chiang Kai-shek Memorial Hall to nearby Democracy Boulevard earlier this month. While many worry that the soldiers will be too hot while on duty outside, the Ministry of National Defense emphasized that weekly basic training includes heat resistance, so it's not a problem. But what exactly is heat resistance training? Let's see what it entails. People are eager to see the honor guard on duty at Democracy Boulevard in front of Chiang Kai-shek Memorial Hall. But in the summer heat and humidity, they worry that the soldiers will overheat in their uniforms. It's tough. We all get really hot just walking around. This is part of serving in the military, whether it's raining, snowing or sunny. To qualify for the honor guard, they have to pass one hour of heat resistance training. After qualifying, weekly basic training also includes heat resistance, so it's no problem for the members of the honor guard to perform their duties. What exactly is heat resistance training? Let's hear from a previous member of the guard. We would wear flight jackets and stand under the sun for 100 to 120 minutes without moving. During heat resistance training, soldiers wear thick flight jackets in weather that feels like 40 degrees. In full uniform and an upright posture, they stand for one and a half to two hours without moving, in a test of mental and physical endurance. Although it may be difficult at the start, training makes recruits tough as steel. No matter the weather, the honor guard represents the bravery and heroic spirit of the armed forces.